Hey guys, today I'm making these tiny little rattles for your dolls. So I have here just two different styles, uh, just in case you don't have all the supplies. So this one here is a little bit easier, just made out of craft foam paper. Um, let's see, if you're new to my channel and you like what you see, please feel free to click that subscribe button. And kids, do be sure and ask a parent for help before starting this craft. Okay guys, so let's get started. So just starting with one of these flower beads that I have, and since I only have pink ones, I'm going to paint the other ones. I first lay out a tack and then some clay and I can place my little flower or my bead on the clay and paint with my nail polish. And here on the sides, you just wanna make sure that you don't cram it into the little holes if you do have these kinds of beads and then just getting in the middle. Then I take a section from the animal growing capsules, the shorter piece that's a little bit wider and I'm just cutting it to size. And I file to make it smooth. And if you don't have these guys, but you have the googly eyes, you can also use those just by trimming off this uh, end piece around the edge. And I place it on a bit of clay to keep it in place while I add glue to the top. And I can glue it to my bead. And I'm just wetting a Q-tip and just trying to get rid of any of that excess glue. And guys, when it dries, I pop in my tiny little beads. I cut out a bit of clear plastic, just super thin clear plastic, which I can then glue to my bead. And I can again place it on a bit of clay while it dries. Next, I take a paper clip and I use my wire cutters to cut off a small section. Place a bead on the end and I'm just using my hot glue here to keep it in place. And peeling off any hot glue. And I forgot the step here guys, but I just added three more beads and I trim my paper clip to size to fit in my flower. I don't want it poking through the middle. And when my beads dry, I can glue it to my paper clip. And then I'm just resting it upside down until the glue dries on a bit of clay. And when done, you are good to go. For my second rattle, I just place my capsule on a bit of craft foam paper. And here I'm just tracing outside of the capsule. So just making it a little bit bigger. And then I just create a shape for my rattle base. And guys, then I'm just scoring it with my mechanical pencil. So just pressing really hard, that makes it a lot easier to um, cut. And I just cut it out. Then I take the smaller setting on my hole punch and I use clear nail polish just to stiffen it up and give it a nice shine. And I do that on all sides. When dry, I place my beads inside my little capsule. Again, place it on a bit of clay, drop my glue on parchment paper, and then I'm just gluing my craft foam to my capsule. And I just make sure that it's lined up properly and leave it to dry. And guys, when dry, I punch out a section from my multi-hole punch, cut in half and glue as ears. And I punch out smaller circles for my nose. and my eyes. And guys, you are so totally good to go. Well guys, I sure hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks guys.